Yeah, Steph and Brian, in our area, tornado warnings are extremely rare, but like you said, over the past few days, four different storms caused multiple tornado warnings. And regardless of if they touch down or not, it's extremely important for us to always get this information to you. That is that indication that there is some rotation in the possibility that there could be a tornado. Within the last week, tornado warnings were issued in Vermont, New York, and New Hampshire thanks to four different storms. We had a couple of tornado warnings. With the help from the National Weather Service. The radar is what we call a Doppler radar, and it detects how fast the air is moving within the, um, within the storm. And so when it hits a certain threshold, that's when we know tornadoes are possible. From there, the NBC5 weather team figures out when the threat is there to let you know. The real challenge for us as meteorologists is the fact that the radar beam is high in the sky. Obviously a tornado is on the ground. So what we're always trying to figure out is what's going on between the radar beam and the ground. When Tropical Storm Isaias moved in, it produced the right conditions for tornadoes. It brings with it those conditions, the heat, humidity, um, and, that, and that turning of the wind or the wind shear, what we call it. Tornadoes also vary in severity, which is why issuing a tornado watch or tornado warning is important. A weak tornado can have wind speeds of 80, 90, 100, 110 miles per hour. Thankfully, the warnings we saw with Isaias didn't materialize to the real thing. Things shaped up a little bit better than they could have been, and that's the good news here. But with humid and warmer summers as of lately, those are the weather conditions to look out for. In the last couple of years, we've had some of the hottest summers on record. In fact, this July was the hottest month ever recorded in over 100 years in Burlington. So you mix that with humidity and then, of course, the wind energy that the tropical system brought, and you have a chance for tornadoes. Yeah, well, thankfully, the warnings we saw yesterday with Isaias uh, didn't actually cause tornadoes, just a lot of pretty nasty weather, but thankfully, we don't have that problem today. <laughs>